friends with you too. This is Marie with It's Me Custom Jewelry. Today's tutorial, we're going to be making this ring. <clears throat> and uh, we're going to get us some 18 gauge wire. Like so. We're going to put one, two, three, four stones in there. These are regular six millimeter little glass pearls. Okay, we have our four in there. We have, what is this, 12 inches of wire, 18 millimeter, and we're going to bend right here like so. Okay. We're going to get our mandrel. to our size eight and a half because that's the standard size and wrap one in this way and the other in this way okay all the way to the front so it's completely one end is this way and the other end is this way. So we have a ring like this. See? So now, we're simply gonna get this little tail and wrap it around the base. This is our base right here. So we're going to get this tail right here, hold tight right here, put it against the base to fold it, and fold. Get your pliers, and really pull on it. It's when it's rings, you have to really pull. See? There you go. And there's my two bands. We're going to straighten it out when we uh, put it back on the mandrel. Straighten it out. Go back up, and that's where we're going to make our bend right here, like so. Hold right here, it helps if you hold it against the um, base to pull so it don't get out of shape as much and then you bend this down 
a little bit before you um, make your other bend. See? Like so. So now we have one this way and one this way. Okay, now we have our ring already assembled. We have one of these ends coming out this way and the other this way. So, all we have to do is decide if we want to uh, wrap it again. Let's wrap it one more time. Let's see. Get our pliers, wrap it like so. So it's three wraps and all. And let's do the same on the other side. When you make rings, it just really just depends on what your preference is, what colors you're going to use and um, I like to tighten it up with this pliers like that get it hold it tight really get it real tight so I can make a clean cut and do the same on the other side really pull on it like so Make that ring look like a ring. Put it back on the mandrel. Shape it again. And you pull down on the ring like this. To shape it. Correctly. Okay. Then we simply get our cutter and snip it right here and snip it right here. Now you got to cut it right. If not, it will it'll poke. So I try to make it in the in the middle right here. And then I get my pliers and I uh, bend inward like this. So it don't touch, so it don't poke. And I even try to tuck it into the other the other bend if I can. And if not, I just tuck it in as good as I can. Like so. Okay. Now we have our ring. And this was 18 gauge wire. Again. 18 gauge and now I have 22 gauge artistic wire this is silver plated and I'm gonna wrap it with this silver plated on top we grab us a little piece which is not gonna take much because the ring is not that big. Snip us off a piece. And you, uh, again, uh, wrap onto the base right here. And uh, you really don't need to uh, make a bend or anything that much because it's going to be wrapped in. So here I made one, one, one bend like that. And I'm going to go back in this way and wrap my first pearl like so. Go back in. Like 
wrap my second pearl here. Make sure you get it in between like this. And the other one. There we go. See? So we're going to go all the way to the end to wrap the end as well. Here we wrapped it. And we're going back. Now we're going to go all the way. We've wrapped. And see how I got that end right there? Now I'm going to go back. If it gets a little tangled, just get your uh, silicone pliers, pull it out, and then keep on wrapping. Wrap it again on the next one. This little tail here, I'm going to cut it like so. What's in my way? Everybody has their own taste on rings everybody likes has a hundred ways to make this roman ring it's supposed to be a roman style that was invented years and years ago and um you can put any color pearls that you like i just think it looks more elegant this way everybody has their own way of making jewelry what might look good to me might not look good to you and what looks good to other people might not look good to us so everybody has their own style so I did two wraps and uh, three wraps huh so I'm you can wrap it more than once. If you wrap it three times, it, you can't see the stone as much. That That's just going to protect uh, the... Uh, straighten out your wire makes it better finish and then we're going to go back again it's one Then you wrap your end again over here. One, two. See? That's how it came out. So we're just going to snip it right here in the end. Get our uh, needle nose. Tuck it in make this as neat as we can and then there and there's our ring if you like my videos like and subscribe and give me a thumbs up this is Murray with It's Me Custom Jewelry. Thank you for watching.